is up guys and welcome back my name is Jax and we are here on our shiny lock challenge in let's go Pikachu so we're going to do a quick team summary which will only take a second because we've only got one mod at the moment we've got our shiny Pidgey with a jolly nature he knows quick attack sand attack wing attack so many attacks enemy remove all right so this is going to be interesting I've trained him up to level 15 um, and we're at a catch streak of 50 Pidgey at the moment um, so what we're going to do is, as a reward for passing the, uh, gyms, we're going to be able to get a Pokemon. So, to get a shiny Pokemon. Um, if one dies, though, we get to replace it up to three times. That's it, okay? So, if we do have any losses, um, where anything dies, then we'll just have to replace it. Um, hopefully, we'll be able to get something fairly soon after it does die, but hopefully, we don't have any deaths at all anyway. Alright, we've got a big pearl from the lady, and let's head into the gym and see how we do. Alright, my hopes aren't very high at the moment. I love how the lights turn on, that's so cool. Alrighty, I can remember seeing this for the first time, so cool. Such an upgrade. Grass or water type. Um, oh, I don't have it in my party. Alright, so what I'll need to do is I'll need to add this Oddish that I've got. Uh, add to party. There we go. Alright. Let's head on in. Pewter City Gym only allows trainers who know type matchups to enter. There are a few types that have an advantage over the gym leader's rock type Pokemon. But, but for trainers who have never challenged a gym before, we have them use either grass or water Pokemon. You have to show me a grass or water type if you want to face the gym leader. Alright, have a look at my Oddish. Alright, this is going to be interesting. Let's see how we do. I'm nervous. Like, I don't, I don't know if we can do this. This is going to be the real test. Against a slightly weaker Pokemon. Alright, Pidgey. Level 7 versus level 15. Let's go for the wing attack and see how much damage that does. That's more than what I thought. But, uh, defense curling is not going to be nice. I might be lucky and they might not know many rock type moves at this level. Like, if they only know tackle and everything, then it should be alright. It's not very effective. Come on, quick attack. We need a crit. Alright. Also, my speed is off the charts just because I had a lot of uh, quick candies. So I just put as many as I could into Pidgey. Which almost maxed it out off of the little ones. So. It's pretty crazy. Alright. Let's see how we go against this trainer. What is your name? Good sir. We've got Camper Liam. Alright, Camper Liam, you are going down. A Geodude again. Let's hit it with quick attack. Well, not quite sure what happened there, but uh, the video just cut out for a second. But we're back. Alright. Should be fine. Hit it with a quick attack. And down goes Geodude. Alright, I'm feeling a bit more confident now, but if Brock has something super effective to use on me, then it's not going to be too nice. So I'm going to go heal up quickly, and then uh, we'll be straight back to be able to face Brock and see how we go. I'm going to be a little bit disappointed if we lose a life on Pidgey, but... I don't think it's really worth it grinding that few more levels just to be able to 
um, go that little bit higher up. I don't know. It's not really going to do any, any good for me. So, especially when I have potions and everything as well. All right. Oddish is still sitting in there as well. Dun, 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 All righty, uh, back into the dream. Uh, back into the gym. Can't even speak. All right, now I'm hoping for an easy battle here, but I'm not convinced. So you're here. I'm Brock, Pewter City's gym leader. You can see by looking at my Pokemon how rock hard my willpower is. All right, bring it on, Brock. So be it. Show me your best. All right, let's see what Brock has for us. He sends out his Geodude. What level is it going to be? Go Shiny Pidgey. Um, let's go for the quick attack. All right, that is not doing like any damage at all. All right, Geodude's doing a little bit less which is giving me a little bit of confidence. But all it's going to take is for a super effective move and then I'm not going to be sitting pretty anymore. Quick attack. Oh, he got a crit hit. This is just a back and forth battle of hitting each other. Alright. I think we'll use a potion after this. I don't know if Brock will use a healing item or not. Bag. Potion. Brings us back up to 28. Alright. This is going to be a tough battle. Did not want to go into bag. Alright. Be able to hit him. Down goes Geodude. Alright. One down. Still didn't get the level up. I just grew to level 8 even though we haven't actually obtained him yet. Um, will you switch your Pokemon? We don't really have that luxury. Hello, Onyx. Alright, this is really, really scary. Let's see what we can do with Quick Attack. Okay, yeah, we're dead. There is no way. There is no way that we can survive this. damage does that do? 12 or something? Mirror move. Rock throw. How much is it going to do? <laughs> that was pathetic. Um. And we're dead. Alrighty, we are back from our crushing defeat. I did a little bit of training and I've got a new secret move up uh, for use. So we have wasted Pidgey's only life so far. Um, and hopefully we can uh, win this time. Because if we can't, then that's it. <laughs> We restart again. So let's hope that that doesn't happen. Alright. Bring it on, Brock. We took down his Geodude pretty easily. We've still got a few potions left, so I think we should be fine. But, I don't think we'll need potions for this one. Alright, Geodude. Oh, 
plate. Let's hit her with a wing attack. Another wing attack. We just gotta hope that we can get a crit on the Onyx. Because then I think we'll have a chance. Boom. Alright. So the next shot will kill it. Please use defense curl this turn or something. Yep. Alright, all the way back to, back up to full. Um Let's hit it with a wing attack. Sends out his onyx. I honestly don't know how we're going to do this. One more and then I'll use roost. I hope roost can't fail. Because otherwise we're back in the same situation again. Even now. Like, I don't think I will be able to do it. I'm not 100% convinced. It's down to half. Come on. Help me out here, Roost. I think the game's helping me out. I think the game is going, oh yeah, I pity him. Because only every second move is being super effective. Uh, come on, get close up to full. Nice. Yeah, I think this game is helping me out. Come on, man. We need a crit. Quick attack. Yes! We take him down. Honestly, I don't think we'd be able to do that without the game helping us. Alright, and we get the victory against Brock. And that means we get our Builder Badge. Bam! Add it to the layout. Alright, we got Headbutt from Brock as well. I guess I should probably teach Headbutt to uh, Pidgey if it can learn it. Alright, now as well as getting uh, that, we also get to add a new member to the team. Welcome to the team, Shiny Oddish. Please have a look at the clip right now. What is up guys, welcome back. We are still on the Shiny Hunt for a Bulbasaur, however... Yet again, another shiny has popped, which we were not planning for. Um, we were only at a streak of uh, 9 or 10, and uh, then this little guy decides to show up. I'm not angry. Let's see if we can catch it. Little shiny Oddish. Alright. Um, we don't need any berries or anything. Stop clicking on that. Alright. Throw the ball. Get a great shot. Let's catch him in a Premier Ball. Three and caught it. Alright. Oddish, welcome to the team. Alrighty, so as you guys can see, we got our shiny Oddish. It's been here all along. We traded it over from the other game um, because shiny hunting on this game, it took me like 70 hours to get a Pidgey. We're not doing that again. So we're going to get the shinies from the other game until we get the uh, sh shiny charm. And uh, yeah, we'll see how we go from there. So this is our Oddish. Um, it is guaranteed four IVs, but I'm not sure what 
the IVs are in. It's got Absorb, Growth, and Acid. All right, so this is going to be a valuable addition to the team, and our next shiny we will get after we beat the Cerulean Gym, which will be in a little while's time. Um, now, before we finish up this part, I want to see if we can teach Headbutt. We can teach it to both of them. Okay, well, I'm going to get rid of Quick Attack because we're already super fast anyway. One, two, and ta-da! Learn Headbutt instead. Alright, power 70. It's pretty good. Alright, we will teach Oddish Headbutt as well. And that is all she wrote. Thank you very much for watching, guys. We did lose a life on Pidgey, unfortunately. Um, but, next time, we'll be able to uh, get the evolution of it. Alright, who have we got here? Alright. We've got five great balls from Blue. I love his theme as well. It's so cool. Smell you later, newbie. Alright, what a cool intro. Anyway, we'll catch you guys next time. Peace!